Pause your scroll. Ever wonder why your keyboard's letters look so random? Meet QWERTY, the layout you use every day, born from a 19th century typewriter showdown. In 1868, Christopher Latham Scholes invented the first practical typewriter. Early models jammed when fast typists hit keys close together. Scholes didn't aim for speed, he wanted to stop jams, so he rearranged keys to separate common letter pairs, slowing typing and preventing jams. The result? The QWERTY layout. When Scholes teamed up with Remington, a sewing machine giant, QWERTY became the industry standard. Even as newer layouts promised faster typing, none could beat QWERTY. Workers had trained muscle memory, and retraining was expensive. Today, digital keyboards could use any layout, but QWERTY's legacy lives on. Here's the twist. QWERTY was designed to fix a problem we no longer face, yet it's still under your fingertips every day. Next time you type, remember, you're part of a typewriter-era tradition that's lasted over 150 years.